Today's episode is brought to you by Manscaped, the leaders in below the waistline grooming, Deke. And in fact, they have an awesome set of tools to use on your set of tools. Ha 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 In particular, the Lawnmower 4.0, where you're able to go over your dangly twins, slow, low, whether you're in the water because it is waterproof, or if you're at night because it does have a light that goes on and off, wherever, whenever, it is there for your grooming needs, for your personal hygiene needs, along with all the other self-hair personal hygiene products that Manscapes offer. And we definitely love Manscaped because not only do they offer those good things, but they even have a promo code for you guys to experience said offers. So promo code is Moats. Use that. You get 20% off along with free shipping worldwide. So shout out to Manscaped. Is that him? Can you hear us? <laughs> Are you in I the building? Hear. Is is I'm that is that the locker mate? Is that is that my Pittsburgh Steelers alum linebacker? Is that my West Virginia Mountaineer almost heaven? Yeah. Is that almost my heaven. is is that him? Is it, that's what I'm talking to, right, Mr. Terrence Garvin? Hey, okay, you know okay. Sh sh shout out to my locker mate then. One time for the culture. One yeah. time. One hey, time. Total, total locker mate too. Like not just not just. In the in the in the training room locker mate. No, 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 no. I like was, like dead I serious was locker mate. Patrol locker mate. Yeah, yeah. I was wooden wooden lockers locker mate. Get, get it out the mud. I was black get it lockers out the mud. locker mate. Absolutely. You know? Absolutely, baby. Absolutely. Let the people know, like true locker mate though. Hey, no question. That's why I tell the people all the time. I'm sorry, I don't throw locker mate out to just throw locker mate out. If it was a teammate, right. that's a different conversation. I've had teammates yeah. who we shared lockers with. But now you had a locker mate. That's a select few. That's a very select few right there. So absolutely, absolutely. So I'm not even going to sugarcoat this thing, man. Okay. How you feel about your Najee Harris? Huh? Okay. You see, be, be, no, no. A couple, couple things now. A couple things. I was because the people okay, was fired up about you. They was fired up about you. They, 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 they want to hear from you specifically because of your tone last week. Okay, we we didn't had a couple of shows since then solo group show and everything is like yo we are gonna hear this dude I T now now Deke then came up here and he addressed it he stood in front of it he didn't yeah. see comfort he sucked solutions and it was good okay now uh, the people been waiting for you to address your take from last week with. This new information that we have currently seen, which was Najee's performance. This new information that we have. This new information. That's all I'm saying. Oh, so, <laughs> yeah. Where, 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 where we at, baby? Talk to me, man. Where we this, at? But we addressed this on the last <laughs> show before this even happened because we knew this was going <laughs> to We addressed this on the last show. Like, what happens if it happens to do some amazing type stuff? And, like, <laughs> Hold on. Because <laughs> we talked about it before we even got here. And I'm like, I think that's even better. I think that's great. <laughs> I think it's even better that he did that. Is he can we talk now? about... Can we, can we talk... Let's talk about what happened and not what we just looked at. I remember... I remember... Look, I remember watching it. And I was watching the hype. I seen okay. him fifty bucks. I seen that. Okay. I watched the hype, and I remember I looked in the fourth quarter, and respectfully, it had seventy-eight yards. Oh, he got it, it. It was running so hard. <laughs> I'm like, he's running so hard for those seventy-eight yards. Those yards came hard to get by. <laughs> All seventy. Oh respectfully. God. Oh wow! So you know I'm just coming telling the truth oh, that I told you 78. I detailed my work like as Coach T was. Saying. <laughs> I'm like, bro, that 78 was a dog fight to oh, go get those. Man. So so you say he worked exactly he, I, he worked too hard for them 78s? What you trying to imply here? You gotta work so oh, man. He had to, oh, man. he had to send me a dude and set the other dude up on the semi to slam this dude like a little kid. Then he went and got two more yards off of that. And we thought it was all the fame run. I loved them. I thought it was a great run. I refused to take anything from that run. I thought it was a great run. So are you doubling down? <laughs> all four yards of that run was a great run. You know where I'm going, bro. I respect. He said that they thought it was a Hall of Fame run. All four Come yards on. of it. 
Hey, yo, Come I on. can't stand you, bro. I thought it was great, bro. <laughs> <laughs> them, them four yards was hard to come by. That's what I'm talking about right there. Answer my <gasps> question. Look, so is this thing, part of your grand scheme? Oh, like this man. was the showcase oh, you're talking man. about? This is my grand bro. I thought I, if I was them, I'd sit it down this week because I didn't got it hyped. I got it hyped now. I sit it down this week. I wouldn't even let you see that for a week. I give me a week of rest. I bring it back next week, and I give me another one of them big time four yard oh, runs. Oh my gosh! And I shop it. I shop it. Yeah, we can't do that till the oh, off season. Man. Yo, you foul. <laughs> you are foul, man. <laughs> Bro. <laughs> and, and the reason I'm laughing is this. Because I see both sides of it. What you're speaking on is very legitimate, especially when you're talking about the professional element of it. The oh, fans boy. go crazy over that stiff arm. As a defender, I'm like, bro, that's a heck of a play by that DB and this defense running to the ball. He only I got thought we was, I thought what, they okay. was biting. They got that's what I was saying. I was with you from a professional standpoint. I'm with you. But from the fan standpoint, I'm like, bro, that was a monster run. The momentum, the energy that it gave. Bro, think about everybody went nuts on that play. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Everybody went nuts. So it's like yeah. I see both sides of it. That's why from a fan perspective, it's like, man, you crazy, man. That was nuts, bro. Like, he getting off. But the but athlete side, yards. the athlete side, it you're was like, a grind. Yeah, yeah. If you're doing yeah, that, that's not going to beat us. If that's As a no, defender, it's not gonna beat absolutely. Us. I'm with you. I, see, I get We're, that part of it. I get that. He's on film, like, ah, that's tough, but way to bite. You slow his feet yeah. down. Look how you slow the feet down. Hey, hey slow it down. The cow, we're going to get you 11 hats to the ball. Yeah. Absolutely. Sometimes the bear gets you. Yep, yep. That's why we jumping him. <laughs> he on, did look. Jumping. Wait, that's wait, why, would you agree with that's this? That's why he's from Lebanon. That's why we jumping him. Yep. He did look they, the <laughs> best that he's looked this year, though. That was probably the healthiest he I looked thought it was and the, the fastest that I he thought, looked. I, thought, I agree with you. I totally agree with you. I thought it was the best, healthiest. Also, that Atlanta field is really nice. Like, I tell you all the time. <laughs> Man, does man. Say he like, likes turf. He I'm like, people home love game. playing in Atlanta. He said, this is, they, yeah. they, said they call it a home game for them boys. Yeah. I thought he played well. I give him that. I thought he played hard. I thought he ran hard. I just think them yards are so hard to come by. Like, I, it all goes back to the yeah, top. You, you working really hard so, for that number, right? That's what you hard said, for man. that. It wasn't a 100-yard day total. I yeah. know that for a fact. And, and is that sustainable, that workload? To get to that yeah. output, King you didn't see them shots. Read. He was, he, was oh, no, he took some shots. shots. He takes shots. He definitely takes shots. He was yeah. getting hit. But that's the part of his game right now. He has to run it like that and take those shots to be but the Najee not, that we not, need. But that doesn't last for a long time. That's a tough life, bro. But you don't need it's it to life. last forever. This the running back. Oh, so, okay. So, so but no, back. you no, you you can't say that to me and come picking in the first round that early. You can't talk to me like that. I you're, agree you're, with that, that part. What fair. you're saying doesn't make sense. You're not going to tell me this is a franchise <laughs> running back, and now you're going to say I don't need it to last that long. Like, make it make sense. Like, D, D, how, how, how long do you need to last, D? Nausea? Yeah, how long you need to last, man? <laughs> what you got for me, man? I mean, we could roll with the backup running backs we got right now. Oh, so. God. Oh, God. I forgot. Oh, oh so you oh. turned on it. Did you hear that? Jeez. Hold on. I'm not turning. You, no. You're not going to say nothing about that? Oh. No, I, I just feel like. <laughs> what was that, D? What was we that, could have D? success D, with anything. That was did. not the answer I was looking for right <laughs> there, man. You were supposed to be like, yeah, man, I think all you need is three, four years. And Najee, man, if he lasts for five, that's great. We're supposed to get that uh -huh. comment, man. Not the any of these running backs give you that. No, man, no. <laughs> I don't know to what degree of, of, of the nausea we just saw in Atlanta, but we could get, you know, 90%. Oh, I would say, based off what we saw from Snow and Warren this year, nausea's way more consistent. He's way more reliable. But I think if you would have given the rock to Snow or Warren last game, we would have gotten pretty similar production. We were going to run good against Atlanta last week. So you would trade nausea. So uh, let me ask you something. No. You would, I don't think we're going to get the, Here's my thing. No, 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 that's no, all no. I heard. I want you to keep put him on your trade box. No, no, because I don't think we're Yo. getting the value that you think we're getting for him. I, I think we might as well just keep him. Oh, my gosh. Y'all really just say, yo, just interchangeable. Just It doesn't matter if it was not. Just put Biddy out there. Put Warren out there. Put mm -hmm. Master T. Man, I'm not I'm not hearing y'all, man. No, man. Benny Snow. Benny Snow. Did you the word you used? You used the word interchangeable. That's a big word. That's a big word. Oh, <laughs> People are saying I'm flip-flop. That I'm sounds not. like I mean, replacing. Not your very good. That sounds like replaceable. Oh, man. He's the RB1. If we get the Harris we saw in Atlanta, we Yikes. stick with him for sure. All right, all right, all right. I mean, 
I can, like I said, I see both sides. Maybe I'm just, I'm, I'm hanging on to the deuce deuce. Okay. I'm still rolling with them. I like the little stiff on four yard run. It had me excited. Nice. But, but, but at the same time, I 100% have said the exact same thing you said because full circle, it happened. Buffalo Bills playing Tennessee Titans. Derrick Henry, stiff arm, Jer- uh, Josh Norman. It was crazy. I was like, it was just three yard mm-hmm. run. So I don't know why y'all showing us a highlight. It was just three yards. So I know what you're saying, yards. TG. I'm with you. I said the exact <laughs> I remember same thing. That run. I was like, it was yeah. just three yards. I don't know why y'all making a big deal about it. It was just three. It was a great three yard yeah, run. Yeah, it was an awesome three yard run. Yes, yes. But that is a part of the game, though, man. But it does give you energy, though. It does it give does. you momentum. That's, that's got to count does. for something. That's got to count for something. It does. I'm not going to say it's not a momentum change. I'm not going to say it's a presence. It, it, those things matter. Yeah. Those things change the game. That three yards might have changed. Like, not to say it like that, but the way he ran it might have affected the way somebody else ran up on, which might have turned into a 10-yard game. True. I'm with you. That's or even looking at the end of the happen. game. Even looking at the end of the game, man, he had a couple of runs to finish it where you're like, bro, they hit him at the line of scrimmage. He still picks up five because they not yeah. as eager to jump on that thing anymore, man. I give him that. I give him that. I give him that. You, you just, know what I mean? You just don't want to roll with it going forward. You just don't want to. You don't want that to be your wifey that you waking up to. I hear I'm you. just like, yeah, you that's not who he is. You don't want to marry that's it. That's not who he you is. You don't want to marry it. Okay. That's okay. not who he is. And I okay. think, I just feel like, bro, if if, if Najee's a second round running back, we're not having none of these it's conversations. It's night and day. You're right. You're if right. He's, if he's a third, fourth, Where anything, you're we're not. It matters. Where you're yeah, if matters. he's Absolutely. If he's third. You're treating them like, oh, we got this in the third. Yo, Martavis, they got Martavis in the third. We love it. was it. like, oh, my gosh, right. look what we stole. We love it. You see what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. Part of the A-B mystique yeah. was we got this in the six. Absolutely. That's the part of Brady's mystique. This is the six. Yeah, six. absolutely. But the fact that it came yeah. on the first day. Yeah. Nah, I expect you to do that. <laughs> I what what Coach Tomlin's little running speech, uh, runners run yeah yeah runners run that's what you're supposed if to do if you're a runner run run the run you know what I mean yep if absolutely you're, if that's man. what your calling card is if you're a guy that runs people or you're physical be physical that's who you gotta be sure. I'm just saying that lifestyle does not last like that just the first round grade yeah. just gives us such a tough time I, I would try it. to give I me a it. second and a third for it right now. That's I just don't we see cannot, how you're that's not gonna that, happen. though, bro. There's like, no I don't see a second and a third going for I think you Najee, gonna, bro. You didn't just see him. You didn't just see him stiff on the dude. I'm talking. No, 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 no. Because the problem is this: what I'm doing appeases fans. What me and you are talking about appeases football heads, <laughs> and football heads don't make them type of decisions because we all know that's not the decision so, you so, make for Najee. So football heads, like that's a four yard run. Uh, absolutely, that's, that, that's a. Okay. Okay. But, but see, I get to wear multiple hats, okay? So okay. I choose to put on my media fan guy hat and play that <laughs> card right now, all right? That's what I'm going to do, okay? Oh. But but the football side of me, absolutely. It was a four-yard so, like, run. You see, Unless, you seen the four-yard run. TG, we talked about this when he first came. We said that's not scary in the sense of body punches aren't going to kill you. I'm worried about that Body. dude that can, they, they can headshot me. I'm worried about that dude that yeah. can, they can take the time. Like, that's the one that's scary. We get the it. Body I'm with you. But we're here now, and we got to roll with this body puncher. So okay. that's all I'm saying, man. We're going to make this the best body puncher we can get. Okay? So we got to beef it up a little bit. If he got to learn some new body combo, put him in the, in the freezer like Rocky did. And he going to beat all the, the body punches he need. If that's what it's going to take for Najee, that's what we in right now. But See, that's where you went wrong right there. But we stopped. Like Rocky you stopped. Rocky, Rocky, stopped. Rocky is like... Rocky's the ultimate undrafted free agent. Story. He is. He is. He is. You can't tell he me is. like Rocky is. But Najee Apollo play, was but, the first round and that Najee got put down. Running. Oh, don't you do that. Don't you spin my analogy. I don't like you, you spin my do that. Don't you spin my analogy like that. That is not how this works, man. Stop that. Right. Boy, man. Good boy. <laughs> I'm not even going to say how I seen the Instagram little side shot. <laughs> I seen the side shots on Instagram. <laughs> it just, oh, and I went the vid, the vid. It just no. Yeah. He did. I know y'all me. seen me. He called. I know my you phone. seen me. I, I blew your listen, phone up listen, off of that. I'm shot? like, answer the, the phone. I left you out of it. I didn't want to take a shot at you. 
I felt like you were brought up. I, I, it could have been way worse. I, I didn't. We didn't even bring you up. Deke. No, Deke. I seen y'all take them shots at me, Deke. and I didn't say nothing. I was waiting to get on here and talk Deke. to y'all. I seen y'all take some shots at me, like no. Listen, I thought bro. they were shots at me too. Listen, bro. He called there my was. phone, bro. It had to be like ten four. Me and wifey. Low key, like about to be out of it, and I'm like, "Yo, was my phone ringing?" And I said, "It was TG," and it was right after I posted. I said, "Oh, I already know what he on." You know, I stalled. I, 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 I definitely pulled the "I'm gonna act like I'm sleep" card, and I played it all the way like that. But I knew when he hit my phone. I said, "Oh yeah, I already know what this is." I'm like, he took a dig. That was a dig. I seen it. I said. He done hit my line at 1040 at night, Deke. Deke, don't nobody talk to me that late at night, Deke. Don't nobody. I said, oh, this is this is for real, for real. That was a shot. This is for real. It took a big ass. <laughs> Both of y'all did. Both of y'all. <laughs> me? I thought we were on the same team, TJ. Uh, uh, wait a minute. Now, Deke, how no, you no, keep no. flip-flopping now, Deke? Come on, no, man. It, you on my no. team, Deke. I'm going to say, because people are saying I'm a flip-flopper right now. I'm going <laughs> to say exactly what's going on. I'm actually the most consistent right. one here. Because All right, so what's the answer? Where are we at now? With me? You, with, on Najee? Yeah. What's, right. the, what's your opinion? Where are you at with He's him? the best running you? back on the team if we get what we got from him in Atlanta. We stick with him this year. We can't get rid of him okay. this year. We can't trade him. We can't do any okay. of that. I don't know if I necessarily even want to trade him in the offseason. Uh, the reason mm. I wanted him potentially not in this Atlanta game was for him to get healthy because I didn't think he looked right at all this year. And this is the game where he looked the most healthy and looked the most fast and had the most burst. So if we keep getting this, I'm fine with him being RB1. But I also do think if we don't have him out there, we can still have a successful running game with the guys that we got. So if we were to trade him for what you're talking about, like a second or third round pick, I think that is good value. And that actually goes back to when we were talking about the trade deadline. I said the same thing. You said like uh, a second and a third. I'm like, yeah, I'm taking that immediately. Yeah, I just that's, don't that's a think huge he's deal in that. Now, okay. now I had a question for you as well, though, man. Do you awesome. think? Do you think that Najee could do the L Bell body transformation? Uh, because you remember L Bell first year, bigger back, thicker, good, but not nowhere near as explosive. Dropped all that weight, came back fourteen, and we know what the rest yeah. was after that. Do you think he could do that? Because he did, like, he's, he was, like, 240, 245, I think it was, in training camp, or uh, in OTAs and stuff like that. So, do you think... 244. Yeah, yeah, he was, he, was, he was a big dude, man. He was big. 244. So, so do you think... I never think, said 244. He told us 244. <laughs> he definitely said 244. I, in fact, he said it to me in, 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 in West on the other show. Yeah. On the other show. He, so you right know right on air. Absolutely. It was, it he was told us 244. 244. He said, I played at that yeah. last year. What's yeah. the he, big deal? He put emphasis on it. You're absolutely right. Okay. So, so how do you he's feel about sure. that? How do you feel about that? Could, do you sure, think that he's capable he, of he that? He definitely could do that. He definitely could do Would that. Would that change your mindset on him? <laughs> uh, Possibly. If it can move better. I just think right now, to me, you know, that's his game. You're, if, if, you know what I mean? You're, you're talking about ifs and this oh, and this. Right? Man, you don't you think, know? But all those <laughs> It's not a big if when we're talking about here in Pittsburgh because we've seen but El Bell do it. About, we've seen James Conner do it. We've pounds. seen D'Angelo Williams do it. You don't got to give me 30. What if you give me 15? We didn't see D'Angelo do that. D'Angelo, D'Angelo didn't dropped. Do that. Yes, he did. Lay, D'Angelo had to get down to t- Bro, D'Angelo also did, man. I would hear Coach Tomlin every single day. Hey, D'Angelo, I don't want you any bigger than 205. No bigger than 205. And he'd be trying to cut, 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 eating all that extra healthy stuff over there, man. Now, I don't know how long uh, he had lasted, but he was definitely on it. He was on it. You know what? He was on You're it. You're right. He was on it. You're right. I'm not even going to argue yeah. with you. You're right. I agree with you on that one. Mm-hmm. At the same time, Uh-oh. <laughs> can I give what I've seen? I'm here. I seen this Alabama running back named don't, Eddie Lace. Don't you do that? <laughs> it, promise. Well, I swear. Before you even say, before you go any further, I swear. <laughs> I literally in my head, I was like, bro, he could go either L Bell or Eddie Lacy after this. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I swear. No. I not the There's fatness, no. not the you. fatness, but I was like, yo, not the he fatness. Can't get thicker. I'm like about the, 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 weight. the weight, like the bigness. The of, like, when you watch Eddie, Eddie was a big dude. Yeah. I was and like, he was yo, running. He was, but he was a big dude. He's a big, he big dude. He had too much area to hit. Yeah. 
I just I'm not into the big back no more. That's just my thing. Like I think you I, I think it's levels to the big back like we talked about. I think there's a big back, there's a power back. I think his style is kind of a little bit of like a even if you look at that monster run, he's shaking mm-hmm. somebody before he stiff him. He is. Yeah. You know? It's not like he that wasn't the beast quake. It's not like like you get what I mean. He's not like running through. And well, I think he's a well, good running back. I feel like I every pre- time you compliment him, it is met with like a non compliment that you just suddenly just <laughs> slide in there like it's not it like wasn't that. like a monster stiff arm. It was a shake it, and then it was a, a stiff, monster it's stiff like, arm. Bro, why is it always like that little bit? <laughs> it's like God dang. I thought it was a monster stiff arm. I'm just saying he's not. Well, you're he's not a, a fan of a big back. I got it. I got it. It's clear. I think it's he's a great clear. dude, man. I think he's a great dude. He's great for the locker room. He's great for this team, the city. I think he is. <laughs> I think he's a great guy, man. I think he fits so many. He takes so many boxes. Oh, my gosh. All right. I do. All right. All right. All right. All right. All right. <laughs> we'll leave it at that. We'll leave it at that. He ain't switching okay? up. He is not. You got to respect it. Yeah, and and I'm kind of trying to figure out where did you end yours at because I felt like you kind of still was going back and forth. I I got a lot of nuance to my takes. Yes. I got a lot of nuance going on. (laughs) All right, hold on. Here it is. Here it is. Because I'm like, I get where T is. I I get where I'm at. I still don't know where you all the way at. Because it is great. It is great because I don't think TG. Us, no, I don't think TG is wrong in a lot of what he's saying as it yeah. pertains to running back value, but uh, sure. maybe he's not getting giving Najee enough credit for still being the best running back on the team and still bringing value to the team as is being a running back and getting the carries. I think he does bring value to the team. I don't really disagree with you like that, and I think he is the best. He's the best running back on the team for sure. I agree with you like that. I just think it's like. But then, not, but then I'm also with you in terms of like if we got rid of him, I, I think we can get like 90 percent of the production. We're not doing that this year. Though. This could be an off season talk. I've, I don't think we're getting a second round pick for him. Shout out my guys. Have you ever seen the movie Shallow How before? Shallow I have. How? I have. I don't. Deep is not a big no. movie guy, but I have it. So in, I've heard in Shallow of it. How. I've heard of it. It's yeah. And you yeah. And you remember the time where he's mm-hmm. standing next to other things and it yeah. looked beautiful. Yeah. And then you zoomed in on it a little uh-huh. bit and it didn't quite look the same. <laughs> yep. <laughs> I think these are one of those moments. Oh like, my god! Ah, uh, what lens are we looking at? That's I think the conversation. <laughs> he said it's the shallow hell. Oh, my what god. lens are we looking at? <laughs> Bro, we looking at the shallow. Hell? Oh my god. <laughs> That hurts because I've watched that movie and I actually enjoy that movie, but that hurts. Oh god, that hurts. <laughs> All right. So I will transition and I will ask you about another thing pertaining to the Steelers that obviously has had people talking uh, coming from Sunday. The rookie George Pickens. Uh, I don't know if you were aware, but he wasn't. I see, I see what happened. OK. OK. So what were your thoughts on the scenario, man? And yeah, everything surrounding. I feel that. like I feel like I don't mean to do my <laughs> horn, but I feel like I told you this. I'm like, he's a superstar. But if he's not super needed in the game plan that week, he's not going to eat simply because the Steelers have had that woman before. You know, mm. if you understand, mm. they've had that. Mm. They've, ha- they've had that superstar receiver yeah. that you just quite couldn't control. I think I think George Pickens is a superstar. Yeah. But I think they're a little bit scared to make him a superstar, if you understand where I'm going. Oh, no, no, I'm with you. Yeah, because if they make him it now, before he's mature enough to handle it, it could kill him. It could be a disaster. I I think a lot of Steel Nation fears A.B. And I love A.B. Shout out my dog A.B. Put that on. You know what I mean? But I think... Time on, time on, time on. You you, you know he's currently in some some stuff, right? Man, listen. Oh, come on now. Come on, babe. Come on now. That's my dog. Hit your boy. Hit hit him up then. What's going yeah, on? I know about I know about the drama. But, I hey, was man. on the internet once again fighting somebody over Come the on, man. Get, hey, you, get that handle, man. That that ain't a good look. You know that ain't a good look, man. Get that handle, bro. I'm, I'm just saying. <laughs> Talk you to know. him. Talk to him. He gonna be cool. He gonna be cool. Uh, you know the headlines always worse than the story. You gotta get the whole story. This is so, true, but the headlines have just it's been bad after bad after bad after. It's just not a good look, man. It's not a good look. Speak from outside. It's not a good look. I feel you respect. Yeah. I give it. And I think that's the fear is to create another monster like that. 
Cause that that think, it's a lot of PTSD still. Every time yeah, he do I something think, public, we be over here ducking. Like, ah, that, that, is that the, ah, that one? I, is, that one is time. I, All right. Even I with Deontay, fear, yeah, I bro. Think the fear is creating that. You said what about Deontay? No, or, he no, said no, even no. with Deontay, Deontay, like, Deontay like, or like when Claypool him. would do yeah, something, you like, like, oh shit, is this AB type? Yeah, of stuff it was again? the fear of that mm -hmm. it was. Could this be another one of those? You know? Yeah. Because as good as it was, it's like can can this turn into a monster? I think. Out of everybody we've seen in the clay pools, the jujus, I He's think this is the most. Yep. This is the one that will turn it <laughs> yes. to a monster. Yes. I swear like I you, I, I think you can see it written on him, and I think he's a dope. I'm, I'm, I'm probably one of his 100%. biggest. Fans. I love it, but I'm with you. I love it, but I am with you. Yes. Like, yes. I, I don't think, I don't think Juju, none of them got nothing on this. Mm -mm. I think this man's a monster yeah. written all yes. over him. Yes, and he's they're special. scared to let it, be, you know. So they tamed it. They tamed it. But it's hard to yeah. tame that, as you know. That is hard to tame. I think his blow up will come at the end of the year. He's going to continue <laughs> to grow. Yeah. Oh, okay. So, <laughs> so not, not a blow up on the sideline. Not on the sideline. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. When I say blow up, I'm not saying blow up like emotional. I'm saying like mm -hmm. he'll become the superstar towards the end of the year. Towards like them last two, three games, I think he'll go yeah. crazy. Like he'll feel. But I, I just, you, that, that's who he is. He showed you, he told you who he is. Like, give me the ball. And, and T, you look at the tape, he open. <laughs> the, the, one, the one play where he flipped out, I'm like, bro, you was open two times on the same play. He was. Like, and I think he thought, I, I think he had conversations with certain people, though. Yeah. He, he yeah. felt confident enough to say, he hey, did. bro, give me the ball. Yeah. And, he and you know, he going back to the think, A. Come yeah. on, man. Going back to the A. It, yeah. Come on. I'm from here. I, I, last time y'all seen me, y'all knew what I was on, and now I'm back home, coming game. This is supposed to be it. I'm supposed to go off hundred plus. Yeah, you know that. We both know that. You, it, probably thirty tickets in the stands for the folks. Yep. Mm -hmm. You see what I'm saying? Come on, man. First one back. Yeah. In the, everybody do it. Everybody does that. Yeah. I'm not mad at him. Yeah. Uh, I I would have liked to see him force him a couple more. I think they can force him the ball a little bit more. I think he's a, a playmaker. But see, I think again, it's more so it. the question at quarterback though. Are you willing to have him start taking more of those chances when we're at four weeks now with no turnovers? And but running they ain't the ball pretty good. He ain't, he ain't got a screen yet. They ain't throwing a tunnel yet. He ain't got just a straight up go get it yet. He no. ain't got none of that. So I'm with you on if we're talking touches, but I thought when you said force him the ball, I thought you were talking about like on the downfield stuff that he was hollering about. I'm not saying that. Okay. But I'm saying you I'm saying he's the type of person you say, All right, look, first play of the game, just throw him the ball. Let's see what happens. I think he's the type of person you say, "All right, look, we're gonna we're gonna get you the ball yeah. a certain amount of times. Like we're gonna throw you this tunnel screen." I mean, they we're tried gonna... to drum it up for Deontay the the first shot of the game, but that was when a uh, Friday fat got beat. But you, heard, yeah. you just said it, you but it was for Deontay. It. You're right. You're right. It yeah, was for Deontay. I think you drummed that up for him. Yeah, because that was supposed to be so... the like sixty yard bomb to start the game off, bro. Even yeah. the red zone pass in the third Girl. quarter mm -hmm. where he threw it up one v one. It was to Deontay, was Deontay. instead of Pickens. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So you went. Like I just feel like some weeks they're like you. Yeah. Just, you're not gonna eat this week. We'll get it to you. Like next week, if you're a fantasy user, I put them in next week for sure because okay. they're gonna throw it to them. Okay. It's a in, uh, rivalry game. They're gonna feed them. They're for gonna sure. let the dogs get dog. You know. For so sure. Like, that's just what I see. That's my two. That's my opinion. Like, I just don't think they want to create another A B, a Martavius. They don't want to create that, and they're so scared of what it, what it. What it, what it was and what it yeah. could be that it's like all right we're not going we're not going to let this just become that we'll tame it. yeah we'll like we'll give it a little sprinkle we'll, we'll we'll sit it down a little bit we'll give it a little sprinkle we'll sit it down okay 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 well you yeah. know i have one final thing that we have to uh to discuss <laughs> Uh, we got we got something big because, to because, because you, you know, know you know the the, the, the the portal has been very yes. active at the yes. collegiate level. Yes, people transferring out, people transferring, transferring in. out, quarterbacks people leaving, <laughs> quarterbacks but, but coming check, in. Check this out. So, check this out. I'm gonna just turn and it over to you. He, I know he's gonna say something to me the same way I'm gonna say something to him. <laughs> but he was on this he was on this call last year and he told me he had a Heisman hopeful. He, he, he did all this. It was this day last year, this time. He told me he had a Heisman hopeful. He told me his world was going to change. It's law we trust. He had a whole slogan. You don't remember all that? I he do. He was doing all that. I said that to him to start the show. I'm with you. Okay. I'm with you. He got a shirt. 
he was making shirts. He was like, we truck, like, you don't remember all that? I wish so, I like, did. You're giving me too much credit. <laughs> he, he, it, it, it was keychains. It was actually keychains. But I'm with okay. you. Yeah, it was keychains, but I'm with okay. you. Yeah. So now what is this? Is this the new future? He told is me. This what we're going? He told me they celebrated Slovis coming in, <laughs> and he said that they celebrated Slovis leaving out. That he said true. that they that's celebrated amazing. the same way. I don't know that's how, amazing. but that's what he told me. That's amazing. That's what he told me. Yeah. yeah. That's crazy. Hold on. That's nice. I mean, it, it could go both ways. How you feeling about JT Daniels leaving? Ooh. Yeah, we let him ride. You Ooh. know, we were done with it. We time. Wasn't he so supposed to be a Heisman? I thought he was it's supposed to be a Heisman candidate. Oh, <laughs> well. That was like the nausea situation. We came. We showed, Bro, we showed, some, we showed some high glimpses of what it could be. We let it be known, and we put it back on the, on the free agent market. Like, right? come trade something for this. We're going to get wow. something for it on the low. You just don't know what we get. Hey, but we... we, we, we we changed that. Say, yo, we test the Najee, yo. Oh my god. Yeah. Najee came. I tried to move the combo from Najee and you still gave him a shot. Damn. But I love yeah, we're him, talking college football. So god damn. But he did he said, I'm win. going back to Najee block just to give him <laughs> one more. Okay, just one more for the road. All right. <laughs> Legit with this dude though, I was telling Moats this on Monday. I'm pumped because I think this dude has a lot more upside than Slovis. Maybe I was going into the Slovis hype a little blind last year, but he's terrible. He, I, probably same thing with you with JT Daniels. I just don't think he's good. But what this Jer Jerkovic dude could do, he was a first round prospect. He's got a cannon. He's way more mobile than Slovis, and he's coming home. Yeah. So I just like that right there. His floor right now is what Slovis did last year for Pitt. But I think he's he got all the upside. Pittsburgh, right? Yeah, he he's from, from Pittsburgh, him. right? So I'm going well, like, in a little bit more light, but I'm pumped about it because I do think he is an upgrade over Slovis. And we should have a good team. I think our team was at its best compared to this season the coming up. If you're going to say 2022 versus 2023. He said the best team was no, I, think, I actually think this team was better. It's tough because we lost Addison. But I think this defense, yeah. offensive line, and other weapons were is best seven this year. That middle, huh? that middle linebacker graduated seven. Uh, he might be back. I think he's got another year. There's there's all these random dudes that are seniors that might have another year of eligibility. Like our best receiver the one might be able to come back. Jared Wayne against West Virginia, which oh, would have changed Lord. the game. Here he guy. go. <laughs> no, but like this team was so good. It's just that Slovis wasn't. But like Pickett was the difference maker, and that's why we went ten and two. Even though, I like it. I said, I don't think that Stop. defense was as good as what this Pitt defense was last year in 2022. But it still What's could that? be decent. Are y'all on the same side as Clemson or North Carolina? On the not on Clemson. not on the same side as Clemson. Same side as North Carolina. So you couldn't make the ACC championship on that side? Yeah. Oh. Wait. Yeah, oh, yeah. No, no, I'm telling you. It was Slo Slovis wasn't good, man. I'm, I'm just telling you. Because we were in a lot of these games, like the Louisville and North Carolina game. Louisville in particular, our defense was really good. We just fucked up in the second half of the North Carolina game. That happened. But Louisville game, we we hey, held them to seven points the you, whole time. I can tell you love Pitt. Hey, you just dropped that F-bomb like that. Like, Lord. Dude, we effed up. We effed up in the North Carolina game. We had that one. It was close. The defense <laughs> wasn't like it was for the rest of the year. That was our one, like, really slip-up game. But, yeah, Slovis just – he was consistently bad throughout the – like, us losing the Georgia Tech. You should have lost the West Virginia. You'll oh, lose the West Virginia no, no, no. next year, though. No, no, no. <laughs> You should have. Y'all weren't a great team. To be honest with you, you threw our whole year off when we lost. You. We could never. <laughs> we never about like it was I that bad. We, we were on your mind the whole time. You keep bringing up. We were on our mind stuff. the whole time. We didn't go bowling. I'm not paying attention to any of your transfers or what's going on down there. You're paying. You're, you got it all on the top of your mind. What's going on up here in Pittsburgh? Y'all not crazy. going bowling either. Are you? Are y'all bowling? We're in four. Not bowling. We. That's what I mean. We could have won ten and two easily if Slovis just would have played. What was better. your record? Eight and four. Eight and four. We should better have, than five we, and we seven, had right? ten wins too. I ain't even gonna lie. In the, the ACC though, in the ACC though, you played Duke, <clears throat> you played Boston Colleges of the World. We Virginia. had a lighter schedule, but it, here's here's yeah. why y'all are nothing. Everything that we'll I'm saying about this Pitt team being good <laughs> said, is we'll valid. Beat you next. <laughs> we took that we'll Tennessee team year. to overtime with our backup quarterback. Slovis got hurt in the first <laughs> half, and he was. This is when he was actually playing good. First two games of the year, he gets hurt. We take Tennessee to overtime. That but Tennessee that's not. Team. That wasn't that Tennessee with the backup team, quarterback right? that was hurt. And they played Bama the next week, if I'm correct, right? Who Tennessee? Yeah, yeah, they beat Bama. 
It wasn't no, the next week, saying, but it was, uh, it was. I think it was in. Oh, within so he's trying weeks. to say that they were l- overlooking. I'm just you saying the look, no. the look, the look. The look was the year. He's saying that, that no y'all way. were the trap game. That's what no he's way. saying. That's that's definitely what he was trying to say right there. <laughs> that's definitely what he was calling you guys the trap game. Hey, no, I think <laughs> he, he is super slick and subtle. I see it. I mean, I see he's it. giving you those, but because yeah. I was gonna say, I do yep. think they played Florida a couple weeks <laughs> after, but then he's gonna say, oh, they were just looking forward to Florida. That is definitely how he's trying to play. Yep. <laughs> that wasn't how it is. <laughs> no, man. Like, we'll beat you next year. You come to Morgantown. Special things happen in Morgantown. You know how it go. I think the last time you was in Morgantown, we whooped you. The I was down there. I think. When, yeah, we whooped you. The time before that is when you uh y'all stole that from me. So now it's time to just tighten things up. Which y'all beat us like twice in the last thirty years or something. So, man, nah, I don't know about that. Yeah. I it's definitely don't know about that. that. We're, oh, yeah, that's we're, a long time. That seems we're, like an inflated stat right there. I'm just saying, I know we're up on the stats on us versus y'all. I know that. You know that, too. I don't know we that. Know. I need to double check. Who, I, I think we might have the edge all time. What's the, is it 16, is 16 to 9? Is that the edge? What is that? 13 to 9. 13 to 9, what's that? Come it's on, the man. a good, well-played game by Pitt. That's what that was. <laughs> well-played game. That's Ooh. a drop. <laughs> That's a drop. That's a drop catch that changed their life. Changed the whole season. If we, if he catches that, wasn't that West Virginia that, offense I, considered I like think the best in NCAA the, at that think, time? I, Nine I points. I think we win the big. Damn, we win the big. I was just we at home. the momentum. Oh, I'm sorry. Team. I mixed up my numbers. My bad, guys. My yeah, bad. You did, you did my, bad. my bad. My bad. My bad. My bad. I feel like I, I feel like something. I touched the wound. My bad. My bad. Yeah, you did. So, jeez, I'm man. So what? So whatever this series is, all right. We we're not gonna bring up the numbers. Okay, all right, all right. He know cool. what it is. Cool. He know. He know. He know what it is. You know what it is. It's all good though. We'll be back next year. Hi. We got a lot of things. we got a lot of things changing and growing in Morgantown. We'll be back. For sure. For sure. Don't panic. Don't so, panic. So quickly, Don't panic. but 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 real quick, real quick before we go, real quick before we go, how we feeling this weekend? Steelers, yeah. Ravens, what's yeah. happening? I like the Steelers. Lamarless Ravens. Lamarless uh-huh. Ravens. Mm-hmm. Lamarless Ravens. I told you, like I said, they're catching people at the right time. <laughs> you know what I mean? November and December football. Coach Tomlin has gotten high. I think the Steelers win. I like something like. Uh oh. Here we go. Here we go. Give me something good now. Yeah. Because last week they threw me off. I like something like 21 10. I think it's going to be low scoring. Okay. Okay. Or, or 17 10. 17, so you said Big Najee Day? Is that what you said? <laughs> Definitely a Big Najee Day. Uh, clock eater. <laughs> throw, the possess- throw the possessions down. Control the clock. I, I don't think they'll super put it in pick your hand. But let me tell you something. And you know I'm from Baltimore. That Raven defense is not no joke. They got two backers in there that's biting. Bro, they like that. Oh, <laughs> They got two backers bro, in there They are they like They do beat Mark- Nobody's giving Marlon Humphreys what he's gotten, but he's mm-hmm. quietly like been mm-hmm. gaming this year. Mm-hmm. Like play like the mm-hmm. of the year type. Like yep. I know all the I know all the hypes and you hear different things. The Patrick Shirtan, Marlon Humphreys over there balling. Mm-hmm. So I would you agree. know, I'm sure I'm sure you'll see him on fourteen. Um I just think it's gonna be about who wins their one on one matchup. Obviously that's what it's always about. Mm-hmm. But it's really about that this week. You'll see a lot of who's gonna win their one on one. Who can win their one-on-one? But I think you'll see the Steelers win this. I don't see a lot of offense coming from that Baltimore unit. Because the thing about it is, when they change their running back, I mean, when they change their quarterback, they come in with a quarterback that's the same as Lamar. Mm-hmm. So you don't have to super-duper change your game plan. It's not like it's just going to be a surprise. Like, example, when Alabama, when Jalen Hurts got hurt and Tua came in, it's like a whole new very game. very different, plan. yeah. You know? <clears throat> I think they stick with a lot of the same plays, same game plan, same everything that you can just scheme these boys up and just come with. I don't want to disrespect, but not as like a backup Lamar right. to the T. So I think this helps you with him not being in the game. I think you'll see the Steelers scheme him up. You know, you'll see a lot of that 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 one high defense that they ran mm-hmm. last week. Minka being the Minka being a a read guy. Down he loves that scrimmage. Read the quarterback yeah, guys, jump routes. Yep. Minka might be the best, uh, like robber in the league. He's one of the best mm-hmm. robbers we've seen in a long time. Like he's that's a skill yeah. for him. He details that. He's very, very good at that. Mm-hmm. Um, 
But I think you'll see that, and he'll turn into the spy as well as the robber, you know, be able to really chase things down. I think that's why I said a lot of one-on-one matchups. I think they'll just, who's the better guy? My guys are better than your guys this week type. Yeah. And I think you'll see Pittsburgh win this one. So that, that'll put them on a little win streak too. Hey, man, that'll be four out of the last five if we can get to people that are, one, man. People, so they're getting high. People are, people are starting to say some weird things like <laughs> playoffs. Uh oh. I'm hearing nothing weird I'm about that. Words starting to pop up. Hey now. Nothing weird about hey, that. Hey now. Hey, hey now. You hear, hey now. You've been hearing them words. I've been hearing them words, man. I've been hearing the, where the losing season okay. and all that other stuff. Like it's just been a lot of that talk that's been this yeah. It's, it's, I've it's, been hearing words it's like nice. play. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Like mm-hmm. Maybe. So yeah. we'll see. I think they win this week though. I'm all still right. on the I'm still on the train. Coming off the body still hot. My dog, my dog. Hey, well, as always, Locker Mate, you know I appreciate you, man. All right, so dog, we're going to do this again as we always do, man. But appreciate you, and I'll holler at you next time, baby. All right, y'all. Peace, bro.